A colony of ants lives near a farmhouse. They found most of their food by the trash can, and they had to carry it a long way back home. They carried the food across the yard. They carried the food through the sandbox. They carried the food past the old shoe. And they carried the food up the ant hill and into the tunnels. One day, someone dropped a shiny spoon in the sandbox. All of the ants kept walking. But the last one noticed his reflection in the spoon. Look how big I am, said the ant. I'm bigger than all the other ants. I bet I'm the biggest ant in the whole world. Then the ant started to feel prideful. I'm not little anymore, shouted the ant. So no one can tell me what to do. I'm not working anymore. The ant dropped the food and went to go play his banjo. The ant played his banjo all day long, and he didn't work at all. The next day, the other ants went to gather food again. Hey, you should gather food with us, the ants told him. We need to work together, and you'll be hungry if you don't. But the prideful ant didn't want to listen. No one can tell me what to do, he said. I'm bigger and stronger and smarter than you. There will be time to play when the work is done, the ants told him. Come and help us, then we'll play together. But the prideful ant didn't want to listen. No one can tell me what to do. I'm bigger and stronger and smarter than you. But we're so little and we need each other, the ants told him. And we need to save food for the winter. Don't you remember what our parents taught us? But the prideful ant still wouldn't listen. No one can tell me what to do. I'm bigger and stronger and smarter than you. The next day, the prideful ant was very tired and he took a nap. But soon, something cold woke him up. It was snowing. He was hungry and he didn't have any food saved up. Now he was willing to listen to what his parents taught him. The ant was feeling humble. Did you know we create lesson plans and activity pages to go with our videos every week? They're made by a professional teacher just for kids. Tell your teacher. Tell your mom. They're on our website. LatterdayKids.com